Hi, I'm Milk, and these are my legendary looks. You're gonna cream yourself. Today's look is Nancy Kerrigan, beaten down. For this look, you'll need a black wig, faux Vera Wang white skating dress, thanks Vera, a medal from a regional competition, Yay. and a prissy poor me attitude. For those of you who were born after 1994, Nancy Kerrigan was an American figure skater. She was beautiful, she was full of herself, she was a pretty princess. She was at the US Championships in Detroit, Michigan, and she was getting off the practice session and Tanya Harding's boyfriend, who was an unknown assailant at the time, came around the corner, smacked her in the knee, and it was the whack hood around the world. Ish. She became famous and so did Tanya. Well, Tanya was infamous, but it became this huge thing, and then Nancy became this, this inspiration for all these little young skaters. And Tanya went on to uh, become a female boxer. I think she boxed against uh, Monica Lewinsky. This look is inspired by Nancy when she was lying on that ground in the Detroit skating rink, crying out, Why me? Take some black, take your brush, very delicate work, and really just start applying under that eye. Don't worry about getting it anywhere. It's not supposed to be, because, bitch, she was hurt. Why did it have to happen to her? Why was God frowning upon her in that moment? She was supposed to win Olympic gold. Lord knows figure skaters wear lots of makeup. She had mascara and eyeliner just running down her face after the whack heard around the world. We are feeling her pain, feeling her strife. Tanya Harding actually has a documentary out. It's very interesting. And in the documentary, actually, funny story, she says, if you can't love yourself, how in the hell are you gonna love somebody? Well, no, she doesn't say it quite like that. I don't know if she got it from Rue, or if, I don't know. What came first, the chicken or the egg? I'm not quite sure, but she's sort of a drag queen. She has mannish features. I started figure skating when I was nine years old in Syracuse, New York. I was not good at any other sports, really. I started teaching myself, and then a coach came up to my mother and said, this boy looks gay and has a lot of promise. And so I started taking lessons and then I skated up until I was 22 and my mom designed and stoned all the costumes I had. And she was surprised when I came out as gay. Love you, mom. I loved, loved, loved ice skating. I remember, oh God. The tears are going down real far, I guess. The next step, you want to make these tears look really wet and fresh. So we're going to add some lip gloss to shine them up. She did not have time to reapply makeup before the camera crew got there. I did this look the first time this past February in honor of the Olympics. Skimberly, my drag daughter, hey Skim. We went out as Tanya and Nancy. And the whole night, she was just chasing me around the club trying to catch me and hit me in the knee. Trivia, Tanya Harding was the first American woman to ever land a triple axel in competition. Did you know that? All right, whoa, I look sad. I look so sad, what happened to me? Why me? <laughs> Is it because I'm so beautiful? Tears are done. I don't need that anyway. We are going to add a little glitter. So we are using, um, this is budget, using Carmex. It sort of, sort of burns, but it's a good type of burn. We can wear this on Halloween to Nancy Kerrigan's house in Massachusetts. Wear it to the skating rink. Ooh. When I first started doing drag, a little side story. I didn't know how to cover my eyebrows with glue. I didn't know, I hadn't heard of that before. And so I always just 
coated my eyebrows with Carmex and then would just put glitter over the brow. It was just like boy brows covered in glitter and then an eyebrow above it. Simple, 10 minutes, and now it takes like hours, I don't know. Okay, I, uh, oh God, ooh. The face is done. So now we are gonna go in with a bruise wheel. Ah! And we're gonna go and bang this, this motherfucking hairy knee up. <laughs> so here's the final look for my Nancy Kerrigan. I have my medal that I won at the sectional championships. These are supposed to be my skates. Why me? Why was I kicked off of RuPaul's Drag Race? Don't you love it? God. You just have to know that you can make it through anything. You just have to have courage and conviction. So go out there and take over the world. Well, thank you. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> and don't forget to subscribe to WOW Presents. <laughs> oh.